you you spent one quarter of your season in Tokyo. What wow. didn't matter which league you were in. Uh, the Tokyo area was enormous, you know, yeah. it's a, like 35 million people. And so, yeah. so uh, uh, we, uh, but we, we all, uh, by the time we got there, there were the 12 teams and there were two foreigners. Uh, not every team had Americans. Some of them had some South Americans or Koreans or uh, guys from Taiwan. They were all considered foreign. Uh, and so each, but each team could foreigners and uh, and so then I came along then in 1975 and uh, I got to join the carp and I'll give you a chance to respond to all that but that I, I can tell you how I got there and yeah uh, but definitely yeah you know, I, I don't think a lot of Americans understand the size of some cities in uh, in in Asia I mean and even all the way you know, I was in Kiev and none of my friends, I don't think, understand the size. And, and Kiev's only 8 million. You know, Tokyo yeah. is even another world than that. Oh, you, you never get out. Of, you know, you go to Tokyo and you never get out of town. I mean, you yeah. just, you get on the get on the train and you just, you, you can ride a train from one end of the town to the other and you're for an hour and you're still in it. I mean, it's just yeah. big. Yeah. It's, you know, to have... Hell, half the teams be there and have the population to support half the teams. You know, that's right. That's on a whole nother level than Cubs, White Sox, Yankees, oh. Mets. It's a, it's another level. Yeah, I mean the whole uh, Chicagoland area when I lived there, and we had the two ball clubs, the Cubs and the White Sox. I mean there there were something like eight million people in the greater Chicago area, and uh, like eleven million I think at that time in the state. Well, I mean, you in, in here just in Tokyo, you had you had uh, all those clubs, and and when you got down toward Osaka, uh, you had uh, let's see, with three teams in the Osaka area or four. Uh, then uh, you know, Hiroshima was a country town. Uh, there was a place called Fukuoka, where eventually, uh, which is down on Kyushu Island, the southernmost island. Uh, and that they had a team there. They've had some teams in other places like Sendai now. They have a team up in Sendai, and they've tried to spread it out a little bit. But their their philosophy on, well, it's not a philosophy. Their business approach uh, on their teams was different. Here, most of the clubs are owned by a organization or a family or something like that. There, most of the clubs were owned by some business, and then, and the clubs, the baseball teams are used as an extension of the business to help the business. Mm -hmm. The Tokyo Giants are called the Yomiuri Giants. Mm -hmm, yeah, uh, they're a newspaper, and oh. so so the Giants would play ball games where they wanted to increase the. Uh, they would go. Everybody in Japan, all the teams in Japan, play uh, about six country games. So you go play in some town that you go play in some place like Lodi or Stockton mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. uh, and so you go in there and instead of having a stadium that'll hold 55,000 people you know you play before 15,000 or 20 whatever they can get in a stadium and uh, but that's uh, uh, they're extensions of the company my club Hiroshima when I was when I was there that club was owned by Toyo Kogio Industries Mazda cars. Oh. Uh, and so, uh, and Nankai is owned by the train line. It was owned by a train line. Uh, and there's a whole bunch of them. There's a number of them that are owned by train lines. And so you, they try to play their country games along the train lines. Oh, very cool. <laughs> so smart. anyways. Uh, yeah, yeah. It, that's really different. smart. You know, that about the Giants, I had always thought it was because it was a, a region of Tokyo, you know, because I knew there were so many oh. teams there. I always was like, oh, when they switched from the Tokyo Giants, oh, that's got to be because that's the part of town they were in. You know, living in Vienna, every oh, section yeah. of town has its own name because it used to be a city. So, you yeah. know, it, I used to live in Leopoldstadt, like right across from the canal from the first district. Yeah, so no. I thought, oh, this is a part of Tokyo. No, they, and uh, they're, they actually, uh, I'm not sure of the their uniforms actually looked like the like similar to the Giants yeah. uh, uniforms. 
Find us every Saturday, 4 p.m. Eastern, 1 p.m. Pacific, on 365 Sportscast radio streaming service. Download the app. Makes it crazy easy to listen.